Hey my loves, welcome to my channel. I'm Sasha Chantel and if you're new here then welcome. I do fashion, beauty, lifestyle and wellness videos on this channel and if you're a subscriber and you keep rocking with your girl then thank you so much for your love and your support. You know I appreciate every single one of you. So in today's video you have just seen me unbox the beautiful Dior Saddlebag Replica from the brand OG Bags and I'm telling you now this brand is fire. I am always impressed, always impressed with attention to detail and when I say it took me how long to open that bag how long did it take me I actually edited so much out but the wrapping the attention to detail the prevention to having no damage like literally I, I'm, I'm literally I'm so impressed I'm so impressed with OG bags and the way the bag came what I absolutely loved in the unboxing phase of this bag was just how much attention to detail was paid, number one, and how much attention to making sure the bag was preserved and not damaged upon trans um, transportation to me was the other part. Like, that was a lot of protection on that bag. I have unboxed several bags on this channel now. You've seen it. If you're subscribed, you've seen quite a lot. And the packaging was a lot. Like, I was a bit blown away by how much packaging there was and how much plastic there was and protection over the the all the different different parts of the bag so talking about the the zips the handles the cd part on the side of, of the bag every single part was wrapped to perfection and tightly wrapped to the point where there'd be no damage on that whole transportation from where it came from to it's coming to me super impressed for that alone we're looking at 10 out of 10 now as a buyer as a consumer we should be really wanting to pay attention to these things like you might think about okay it's coming to me as long as it comes out okay it's, it's all right there's so much more to it than that the better the bag is preserved and protected the better quality it would be when it comes to you now some of those bags are coming from very far and I'm so impressed by the presentation and how it came like the box is gorgeous there is literally nothing setting this apart from the original in terms of the design the clear clean white box the Dior in gold on the front nice sturdy box and you know like we women we like to like present our designer boxes on our shelves and so forth this can be presented sometimes I've received bags that just come in the dust bag sometimes just wrapped in plastic and nothing more they did not hold back at OG bags like literally they make you know your bag is worth something and actually the replica bag is worth a lot but I'm going to break down every single part of this bag so you know exactly what you're buying when you get it so I had not had a Dior saddle bag before which is why I chose this one now I just absolutely I d where do I start like seriously I love it I'm going to take the handle off because um, the strap off because I just want to hold the bag on camera in front of the camera just to show you it close up even more detail because seriously and just to mention the strap is fantastic quality like I have literally pulled at it and tugged at it and I've checked the clasp on the actual just to make sure it clips back because I have bought things or you know I've been sent things that just have little faults and those little faults can actually cause a lot of problems down the line you want your straps to actually be sturdy and made to perfection so they don't fall off and when you put it on the strap it won't come off when you put it around your when you put it over your shoulder but yeah again the strap is beautiful absolutely beautiful now just give you a close-up of the bag like my loves it's stunning like everything about it is stunning like there's the d right got the cd part on the side and there's literally no tarnishing to it there's no damage there's no scratches there's no faults this bag is quality and you saw how much i can't stop stressing it because that is the most i've seen on a bag that's been sent to me just so much attention to making sure it's protected so we've got fantastic stitching on the bag there is no faults in that stitching. Sometimes you get replica bags, and again, you can see some little faults in the stitching. And that's not a tack at the brands, but you know, that just literally straight away shows that it's not the real deal. The stitching is not very good. The stitching of OG bags, you're getting that quality. You're getting a fine stitching, that attention to detail, and they haven't missed the mark so far absolutely not there's no tarnishing like i can mention there's no scratches and the gold is really strong like i think the camera picks it up but it's very shiny really nicely detailed and it's just yeah the stitching along every single part of this bag is 
on point. So let's talk about the bag itself in terms of design. I have always liked the saddle bags, but I never felt really compelled to buy any. Um, I'm of a classic lady myself. I like that classic black bags, classic, you know, really no patterns, nothing on it really, but I just like the way this looked. And it's like, it's, it's a blue Dior detail on it. So literally it's, it looks so good with the denim already. I'm wearing a denim jumpsuit. And just together, do you see what I'm seeing? Like, can you see how much that looks? Like how good it looks? I love the way the color just works with the denim and it's just, oh gold buttons gold detailing gold everything gold just makes me happy like i have mentioned in previous videos i don't like silver much i used to love silver jewelry growing up but as i got older i literally gravitated towards gold detailing gold jewelry gold accessories and stuff like that so for me this bag is just yep yeah, it ticks that box we've got the back pouch part here where you can put like your bus pass or like your wallet with your cards in it and that would sit quite nicely there it would have that risk of someone taking it because obviously that's the part that's facing you so it's quite a nice my hand goes partly in like that so it's quite deep half my hand fits into that slip part of the bag on the back then if we open the bag it's quite a tiny bag, I'd imagine it's just one of the smaller saddle bags from the collection. Um, but on the inside here, it has a serial number on the side. So again, good attention to detail. I've had replica bags that have missed out any type of number. But the serial is what actually makes it seen as an authentic bag. So you want to have that as close to the original as possible in terms of design, attention, and the de detailing of the bag. You know, that way it will not stand out as being a very bait um replica bag because you want your bag to look good and these are top quality and i'm going to go through the price point so you know exactly what i mean by top quality they're not an average bag you can buy on the street for like 30 40 pounds We're looking much higher in the price point here but that is because the detail is exceptional and you're paying for quality regardless if it's the real deal or not so again the dior patterns all over the bag I haven't mentioned smell before in previous videos, but honestly, there's a difference in quality bags and how they smell. You can tell that this bag is quality by how it smells. When you open the box, it has that clean leather smell. Now, I cannot say for sure, so I will never ever endorse or say anything if I don't know it for fact. I, it gives the impression it is genuine leather. The price point probably points to the part, part of it being genuine leather, but I don't know, because it doesn't say on the website. I can't see it. I've looked through the entire site to see that, but hopefully the brand will let let me know i can actually put it in the description box at a later date but seriously my loves this smells so good upon opening it smells so nice that new bag smell like those women who know who buy bags like i do will know what i'm talking about that clean fresh amazing brand new bag smell that's what the dr saddle bag replica from og bags smells like it smells divine right so I'm probably going to wear it without the straps more time because I just like the way it looks in my hands and I probably only put the strap on to have it on my side just to show that aesthetic and give that look but I think eventually I'll take it off and just carry it like that because I love how demure it is I like how dainty it is it's very light this bag is not heavy it's very light so that means it's very accessible now in terms of size and what it can hold it is quite a compact bag as I mentioned before so I'm thinking it would fit my wallet it will fit my phone yeah it fit my wallet my lip gloss my keys and my phone and i think that would be as much as this version could hold but for a quick date night you don't, you don't need much apart from your wallet your purse um your phone your lips gloss and your you know um your keys if you have your car keys or your home house keys um depending who's driving on that date <laughs> but it doesn't hold a lot but it holds enough for a basic night out um or a basic like a brunch a dinner date whatever you don't have to carry too much it couldn't be used as a day bag it's just not big enough but in terms of an evening and evening use just going to a concert or something i need a few things to make sure you had it on you like your phone and your wallet and so forth this is the perfect bag for that 
it reminds you, it gives me dinner vibes, you know, it gives me like beautiful restaurant aesthetic vibes. Having it on the table, taking pictures, having it perched beside your drink, like that is this bag and that's why I liked it. There are other clean, plain versions of the saddle bag on OG Bag's website, but I wanted the fussy one for a change. I wanted to step out of my comfort zone and just try something a bit different. So that is the bag in its entirety. You know, it hasn't got an inside zip. So that's what I mean by it's compact. It hasn't got like a load of space. That is what this backward pouch is for. I guess it makes up for lack of actual pouch or zip inside the bag. But again, it is just for a simple use of like a date and so forth. It's not a date bag. It is an occasion bag. It's a statement bag. And without a doubt, this bag makes a statement. I am in love with it. And I was desperate to do this unboxing just so I could show it off and start carrying it outside there will be some still photographs for on my Instagram which is linked below and my loves I am trying to get to 15k followers so if you don't follow me on there why not show some love to your girl and make sure you subscribe to my socials they're all in the description box below also details to this bag and OG bags website in its entirety is in the description box now your girl has gone through that site with a fine tooth comb to make sure it loads well pictures are there and so forth and so far so good so let me just show you the website now on my laptop but yeah for your eyes here's the beautiful cd saddlebag absolutely loving it the christian dior saddlebag replica from og bags let me show you the website and take you through some of the features of this bag that i do not know off head but that you need to know so laptop to the ready you know how i do i've started to do this in this segment in the video just to make sure i've missed absolutely nothing and so the it has on the website that it's verified secure 100 percent secure so when you make a purchase on the site it has this these details here that tell you that your car details are protected so there's no worry or concern around that what i love is it gives you a multitude of pictures of the bag like all of these are images of the saddle bag on different um different angles so let me just bring that down so that's it on the side and you can actually put your cursor along it and move it along to check the detailing of the bag yourself um and there's other images below that so you can look at the detail of the actual d that hangs off it shows you detailing of the christian door stitch and the actual logo inside and it actually goes down to detailing of saying paris underneath and then made in italy below that so there are about seven photos five six seven about eight photos in total and it also shows you a close-up of the straps you can see it in the pictures now this bag is a 17 by 5 by 15 centimeter bag so, so i mean it's quite compact it's quite small as i mentioned but again this is an occasion bag it's not for daytime it is to make a statement is to look nice and sexy or grown and sexy should we say so um they literally mark the package as a gift and declare the value less than $50 to help avoid custom duties. So when you order from OG Bag, you don't have to worry about custom duties or extra tax costs, which can happen when you buy from bags shops internationally. That problem is taken care of by the brand directly and they're very transparent about that and they tell you on the website itself. Um, they also mention at the bottom about the quality of their bags. So I couldn't confirm if it was literally made from leather, but honestly, I have leather bags and this is very close like the quality of the strap everything is just above board and doing what it needs to do you can contact OG bags on whatsapp and their details are on there as well their customer care is on point the shipping took about six days it was so quick I was like I had the communication with the brand and literally there it was on my doorstep it was with me um, so the actual price of the bag in US dollars is $329 so that's what I'm saying about the quality it's not a cheap replica you do not get cheap replicas on OG bags you're buying quality bags that will last the test of time that will give that aesthetic level you up in terms of how it looks the styling if you're a content creator like me it just literally takes your, your content to the next level and if you're a fashionista but don't want to spend thousands of pounds in the bag or maybe you're not actually ready to buy a bag at that point because of the price point this is a great place to start just to get that elevated look just to get that aesthetic that clean gorgeous well presented 
um, very well made quality bag and OG bags are literally doing their thing it is absolutely amazing what an exceptional brand I love everything about it it also has votes on the site from customers who are, literally have rated the bag and it's got 14 five star rating and I think that's absolutely amazing you know I can't fault this bag I'm in love with it it's fabulous and so there we have it. I think I've covered everything I can on the bag for you. If I've missed anything, the details to the bag are on my description box. If you actually see it on there, check it out for yourself. But OG bags, my loves, I'm impressed by you. You have left me dumbfounded. I absolutely love this bag and I feel it's my favorite to add to my collection. And I really do hope it encourages you to add it to yours as well. So my loves, if you've enjoyed this review, please give me a thumbs up and leave your thoughts below do you like the bag do you not like the bag do you have your own duplicate and replica bags let me know i'd love to hear from you and as always thank you so much for supporting my channel and for supporting these type of videos i really do love and appreciate every single one of you and i will see you in my next video shout out to og bags for this collaboration and i will see you lot soon all right my loves take care bye